This Friday, the Toreros men's basketball team is taking on San Diego State in their season opener. Last year, the Toreros came out on top at Peco Park against the Aztecs, and they're hoping to repeat history this Friday at Viejas Arena. How have you guys prepared for the season so far? You know what, we've been uh, trying to make sure that we do a great job defensively uh, on the glass, the backboard, since we're an undersized team, and then taking care of the ball. And we feel like if we can do those three things, it'll give us a chance to win ball games. With so many incoming freshmen uh, and you're only a sophomore, you're already considered like a veteran on the team. How does that feel? Um, it's it's something to get it's something to get used to. Uh, it, it gets tough at times because I'm still young. My, I'm still young myself. I'm still trying to learn, but I think it, I think it's helping me uh, progress faster because I'm having to learn on the fly and try to teach others at the same time. How has Allen Carter the third uh, affected your team so far this season and last season? Well, you know, I think this year he came off of a spring and a summer where he was a tremendous leader for our team. He's made great growth in all, every part of his game. And uh, being a sophomore, but being a guy who started 27 games, we consider him an upperclassman on this team. Have you felt like a leader to these incoming freshmen? Uh, yeah, I have. Uh, there's times where I feel like they they lead me sometimes and it's not always just a one-way thing so I think with me being a sophomore and some of the freshmen being the same age as me it's kind of like a mutual thing like sometimes I lead them but sometimes they come over and talk to me and say hey you need to do this hey you need to do that and it's just all working out good yeah with so many incoming freshmen on your team this year a lot of newcomers how do you think that's going to affect your season you know what we're going to have some growing pains uh, we, we're not naive to understand that we're young but i think these guys bring us some tremendous size some athleticism and some skill and they're excited about playing and so we're excited about the youth movement here at usd san diego state was a big win last year uh, what are you expecting playing them this friday uh, I expect them to come out with twice the intensity they came out with last year. Uh, they're bitter from that loss, so it's going to be a fun game. I know they're coming out to come out our heads, and we're going to do the same. We're trying to get another win. Yeah, you know, last year was a fun game. Obviously a, uh, a historic game being played at Petco Park. Um, two totally different teams than this year. They inserted quite a few transfers and some guys with some size. Uh, obviously, as you know, we have some transfers. So this year is going to be a completely new game. And then again, on their uh, home court at Viejas Arena, which is one of the best venues in all of college basketball. And we're excited that we're going to be able to compete in such a matchup this Friday.